Hello everybody, my name is Mike Quintana and welcome back to Prey. We just got into the, I think it was Calvino's office. And we're making our way through to hopefully get the access to the propulsion system or something or other, so. But we have to be careful because we are playing on nightmare mode and we have to deal with a lot of crap. Speaking of that, let's kill this machine. Oh no, why am I holding zero of those? Uh, give me that. My glue gun is a useful thing to have. And I don't know if there's anything in here that can help me. Who was that? I'll take that. Ugh. These robots are scarier than anything, just to be honest. I don't even want them to hurt me because I know they're awful to fight. So we're going to try to navigate our... <gasps> There's a canister. Okay, we can use that. Let's, uh, we're going to lure the robot close to that and then sh shoot it. Okay, there he is. Come on. All right, they're dead. They're dead. They're dead. They're dead. Okay, that one's dead. Now we can kill this one. Die, die. Okay, okay, okay. Smack him to death. No, kill him. Kill him! Kill him! Hit him! I'm pushing the button and it doesn't do anything. Oh, okay. We killed two robots without taking much damage at all. Hooray! I did a good thing. Oh, I hear mimics. I hear the little clicky sounds. I know they're in here. Are you a mimic? <sighs> no. Are you a mimic? No. What about you? No. I hear them all over the place. It's like they're everywhere. Well, there's no reason to even be over there. Oh, is that like a bandsaw? It's crazy. Um, where are we? Or something I can repair over here. <gasps> there's the moon. Whoa. Parts required repair three. Oh, shit. Well, I'm not quite ready for repair three right now. Give me my pistol, because I want it. Where is it? Oh, there it is. Hey there. You're not hiding very well. Die. Man, I used a lot of ammo on that guy. For no reason. What's that? Can I grab those? Clean spirit. Interesting. Uh, so what about this? Uh, repair- parts repaired. Uh, I can't repair that. That's a shame. Because I'd totally love to- I'd love to get the lights working in here. Radioactive? Uh. What's the- what- why- why would I want to be over there? What is that? Uh. Danger radiation restricted zone. Oh, shit. I can't go over there. Why would- yeah, I legit can't go over there. That's weird. Okay, interesting. Uh, what's this? Uh, should I be concerned? There's a big claw mechanism. Interesting. Oh, let's focus on the- Nope, not, uh, not trusting that. You can die. Oh, no, 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 die, 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 die. Thank you. Jesus. No, 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 die, die! Oh god, no! Uh, eat, eat, eat! Uh, crap, crap, crap. Uh, bullets, bullets, bullets! Whew. When wrenches don't work, bullets, always. Okay. Uh, internal lock use. Mm -hmm. I'm not ready to go outside, though. I can't repair that either. Crap. What's this? I haven't been up here. Oh, email. Okay. Uh, the Huntress is ready. Okay, guy. Uh, I think it's ready now. I've dubbed the Huntress Boltcaster, Clive. I love your idea for compactive tips on the bolts. What? Oh, capacitive tips. Okay, so you can shock people, I guess. Uh, send me a technical spec and I'll incorporate it into the ammo fabrication plan. Those tips will activate any touch screen if they've hit. I've gathered a lot of trash for feeding the fabricator, so we can make some of these after work and try them out. Interesting. 
Missing operator parts, uh, Daniel Show. Have you looked for the operator dispenser logs and the missing parts? Uh, every operator in the station needs to be accounted for. I'll bring it up with Alex next. Danielle, interesting. Fabricator malfunction from Clive Lawrence. Ah, the phantom that killed the other guy. I checked the Neuromod stamps and the uh, lattices in the fabricator both check out. There's no obvious failure in the components. I may need to disable the machine. It's possible there's something in the specs Igwe's using that's causing the failure rate. Hard to believe Igwe's pretty thorough, but we all need to make but we all make mistakes. I'll keep working on it. Maybe there's something specific about that batch. Weren't there a few scrambled ones in the last cycle too? Hmm. So apparently there's something wrong with a fabricator that's causing problems. What's this? Uh, excerpt from Engineer Clive Lawrence's work journal. Uh, entry 4. Uh, preliminary tests with an increased spring constant are proving promising, but it's tricky to getting fabricators to, fabricators to make them stiff enough, not brittle. Another option is scavenging cargo brought up from Earth. Thornstein's assistant has an eagle eye, though. Entry 4. Sub supplemental. Dear Clive's diary. He's just trying to impress Mary by coming up with an improvement to her toy gun design. Even if it was smart enough to improve on her work, she'd never give him the time of day. Uh, entry four, supplemental, supplemental. I'm well on my way to figuring out how to increase the range and stay the hell out of my journal, Franklin. <laughs> wow, that's funny. So, uh, journals aren't private here. That's good to know. Uh, anything, anything else down here that I should know? Stop that. Stop that bullshit. I'm exploring. I'm exploring things. Can I climb up here? Is there stuff? They're goodies. I'm gonna start climbing on top of cabinets now, because there's always stuff up here. Ooh, another place. What? Spooky space stations. Gotta love them. Lots of random noises. Always turbulence we can't explain. Uh, conveyor controls. Warning, cargo conveyor scheduled maintenance required. Do not operate conveyor without proper authorization. Um. What? Wait. Should I, uh... Oh, let's try it. Oh, there it is. Oh, it dropped something on the floor. Interesting. <gasps> oh, the dead guy! Oh shit, they're all mimics. Uh, um, um, no, 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 no. I will take you guys one at a time if I have to. Hey, die. Come, come over here. Don't you want to die? Come on. I will kill you with my bare hands. Alright, who's next? I know you want to die, come on. Oh, that cart's not going to save you. Ah! Okay, that's another one. Ah! Okay, wait, we have to heal. We have to heal. Oh, shit, we can't heal. Let's just keep our distance, then. Uh, we're just gonna keep our distance. Okay, that's cool. Uh, I got seven bullets left. That's fine. We can work with that. Uh, I've had to work with less. Uh, engineer. <gasps> he had a Neuromod! Awesome! Why didn't you use that on yourself? I'm wondering. It's probably why he died. Uh, I killed him. I killed a mimic over here. Oh, yeah, there, there he is. Uh, that's not useful at all. Anything else? Anything else I should worry about? Mm, Peter Coleman. Interesting, interesting. Oh, there's shit in Oh, my God. Oh, I can't carry any of that. What do you mean I can't carry? It takes up two slots. Oh, I see. I see, I see. Wait, hey, reorganize that. I have room for something like that. <sighs> weapon upgrade kit? Hold up, maybe, um... Hold up, let's try to use some of our weapon upgrade kits because we have a, de a reasonable excuse to use them. Wait, no. Upgrade. Oh, I have to put it on something. Um... Eh, what, uh, should I upgrade my glue cannon? Sure, let's, let's upgrade it. Why not? Incapacitation rate, 120% in, uh, handling. Range... Reload speed. I'd say handling. Yeah, that's better. Cause I'm I don't know what it is with the glue gun. It just feels a little like uh I don't know, weird. Alright, now we'll upgrade our pistol again. Magazine capacity, range, accuracy. Zoom in. Wait, can I zoom while holding it? I never tried that. Mm, fine, I'll do it to the glue gun, because the glue gun needs help. 
All right, now I can go in here and pick up the medkit. All right, cool. Can I zoom while holding the pistol? Nah. Okay, I don't know what it is. You can't look down sight or something. Every airlock yes? has a manual seal you'll have to disengage before you can spacewalk. Mm -hmm. While engineered as a safety measure, it's irrelevant when the enemy is already inside the station. If you do go out there, I wouldn't stray far. The Typhon may have spread to the exterior. And remember, other airlocks you find will have to be opened from the inside first. Last thing, you don't have a propulsion system for your suit yet. You'll need one to maneuver. Yeah. Okay, so we have to get the propulsion system ASAP. That's why I came in here! Was so I could handle that! Ugh. Okay, we're gonna have to find one at some point. I can't repair that. Yeah, there's a machine in there. <gasps> Can I get in there? I think so. Oh, Jesus. I can't put out the fire. Oh, wow. Okay, well, can I at least patch the leak? All right. Well, I patched the leak. Oh, we need to patch the oil, too. Uh, here. All right, that stopped. Okay, maybe I can cross now. All right, we're good. I'll take all that. All right, we're making our way, making our way. Can I get in here? Wait, what? Huh? Hold up, what was the point of coming back here? Oh, we can make a staircase. Here we go. There we go. All right, we'll walk our way up. Maybe there's a way to drop down in there. <gasps> oh my god, a recycler! Oh! Come here! Thank goodness. Oh crap, what was that? No. Nah, -uh. put that back, put that back, put that back, put that back, put that back. Transfer junk. And transfer all these freaking wrenches. Jeez, I don't need all this. Okay, then sort everything. Thank you. Recycle all of that, please. Yay! <laughs> Finally, my inventory is free. Alright, now, can we craft stuff? I heard we can craft the gun, so does that mean we can craft the bullets? Yes, we can! <gasps> yes! Uh, add ingredients? Sure. Yes! Give me the bullets! Hell yes, hell yes. Craft more bullets, please. Yes! Oh, just give me tons and tons of bullets. Just nothing but bullets. Oh, I'm missing something. Uh, I'm missing one. Oh, no, I'm not. Create it! <laughs> God, it'd be so cool to have 3D printers like this, like, actually in our houses. You gotta think about it. We're not that far off from this technology. Place ingredients. Oh, cool. Like, can I just make an infinite amount of bullets? Because I would use my gun non-stop if I could. Oh my gosh. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. Just keep it up. Let's just make a lot of them. There's no reason not to, right? Alright, let's check my inventory. Because I'm, I'm concerned. I have 90. 99 millimeter bullets. Oh my god. I still have a lot of this stuff, too. Wow. Oh, wow. Okay, I had a lot of material. Alright, let's see how much my gun has now. 187. <laughs> oh my god! We are set! Look at that! 15 of 172. Hell yeah! Sun-dried tomato jerky. Alright. Alright. I'm feeling good about this, guys. I'm feeling good about this. Transstar uniform guide. Excerpt from Transstar New Hires Materials. Uh, do I really want to read this? <sighs> Might as well. Your Transstar uniform has been designed for your safety, comfort, and to facilitate your work. The uniform must be worn at all times while aboard the station. While every effort has been made to make the Talos a comfortable and safe place to work, there is always the chance of an accident or hazard. Departmental assignments can be determined by uniform style and color. Brown and black, corporate and administrative. Brown and black. Interesting.
What's the red and black? I think that's what I'm wearing. Green and white, science and technology. Orange, engineering and maintenance. Blue and black, security. Interesting. Emails. Uh, don't sweat it. Uh, this is bolt effectiveness. When the cat's away and all that, uh, I think I have a few ideas. I'll draw something up and set it to you and Mary. Uh, sorry for the bolts all over the machine shop. It's really the only place I can try out the new gun. I think it's coming along rather nicely. Still want to help? I've already recruited Mary. Why are you guys building... Why are you guys playing around? I guess there's so much to do on Talos that they don't have time to... To have fun. The satellite presently in repair bay of the machine shop is scheduled to be de decommissioned. However, Dr. Kelstrup has requested that we remove the psychotronic translate transistor elements and install them in a new satellite. I don't know what they do, so don't bother asking. Just get it done ASAP. That's what the satellite is in here. So the thing that's under the floor is a satellite. Okay. <gasps> Propulsion system fabrication plan! Hell yeah! Ooh! Can we fabricate it? Oh god, did I use all my crap? Okay, good. I can make it. Alright. We're going into space, guys. Hell yeah. Oh, let's put it on. Hold X to while falling to glide your... Ooh, interesting. Flex foam bullets. Eh, do I really want that? Do I really want that? What's this? What would be the point in, uh, in using those? I hear something over here. Alright, so there's no way to drop down to get into the room that's below me. I wish there was, but it's okay. But at least we've made enough progress to where we can actually go into space in this episode. Wait. <gasps> Wait, can I get up here? Hold up. Wait, uh, give me my wrench. I don't want something to explode on me like it did last time. That would that would be ungood. <gasps> there's stuff in here. Ooh. This game rewards you for just going around and exploring. Like, I didn't have to come up here at all. That's cool. Ooh. Ooh. Ooh, I'm just gonna climb on top of things now. Hold up. Give me up. Ah, oh, no! Alright, I'll try to get up here. On top. On top. Ooh, what's that? What's that thing? Okay, never mind. Probably isn't important. Ah, uh, climb up. Climb up. Oh, this is radioactive up here. Um, ooh. <gasps> There's a person up there with recycler charges. Um, okay, how do I get over there? Hmm. Ooh, I can glide. Interesting, interesting. All right. Uh, I'm almost there. Maybe if I jump from here? <gasps> yes! Oh, yes! I'll take that. Glide to the cargo platform. Hell yeah! Franklin! This was Franklin! He was the guy that was reading her, uh, this, this diary or whatever. Well, sir. Karma finds us all. Alright. Oh, this is a different telescope. Let's see what they see. The moon. That's a very, very good moon out there. It's so interesting, that is. That's cool. Man, I love space. Space is so cool. Okay. <gasps> Wait! Recycler charges! That means I can get in there. All right, let's activate that. God, I get so distracted just doing random things. Uh, no, not in there. Where is it? Here it is. Uh, put that down. Oh, I assume when I immediately when that gets activated, the machine's gonna run at me. So, let me put my glue gun out so I'll be ready for that. No, switch to the recycler charges. All right. Wait, what? Oh, come on! I destroyed stuff like that before. Hold up. Press R2 to place. Run! Can I detonate it? Wait, can I detonate it? Uh, how do I detonate it? Oh no! I'm wasting all my recycler charges! How do I detonate it? Wait, would shooting it, would that work? Uh, let's try shooting it with a, with a gun. How does this? I thought you could place it to like get it to like activate it or something. Isn't there some kind of remote detonation? Maybe that's a skill that I don't have. Maybe that's it. 
All right, well, I'm not going to waste too many more trying to fill with that. Uh, we're going to go ahead and go outside into space and not delay. Oh, wait, I have neuromods. God, I promise we're going to go into space. Okay, I have two neuromods now. What can I do? Upgrade uniform, extra inventory space. Ooh, that's nice. Thrown objects will damage enemies. Okay, what else do I need? What else did I want? There was something I wanted to save for. Mm, firearms. Increased damage to the weapon. Ooh, wow. Holy shit, that's good. Uh, leverage one. Not getting there, sorry. Spare parts, suit patch kits. Okay, this is what I needed. Um, allows the use of weapon upgrade kits uh, beyond the non stand beyond level one. So I'll wait until I get some more neuromods for that. It's okay. Oh, wait, what's that? All right. Use terminal. Shit. It's all right. It's all right. We need to activate it. Use it. I'll give you some space. Oh, thank you. Give me a little walkway. Yeah, let's go outside. Sure. What's the worst that could happen? Uh, yeah. I haven't been in space in so long. Feels like it's been two years since I last played a game where I was put in space. Like, actually in space, like outside where you're floating around and stuff. Microgravity detected. Whoa. Oh, shit. Your Transtar suit is equipped with a propulsion system to navigate the harsh environment of space. To navigate in zero-g, use L to thrust and L3 to boost thrust. Press that to br- Oh, God. You can- Oh. What? Oh, uh, okay. I'll figure it out. It says press something to roll? That's weird. Whoa. All right, let's go. Oh, there's a human corp. So where's our objective? I got confused. Oh, you roll with both of them. I see. Okay, that's cool. Alright, so it's very intuitive, actually. Do I have a limit to how much power I have? Alright, 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 alright. Let's, let's focus on our objective. Dr. Lorenzo Calvino. He's over there, 38 meters away. That's actually not that far away. <coughs> oh, shit. Are we gonna have a problem in here? Whoa, this is cool. All right, let's go talk to this guy. Oh, talk to his corpse. Whoa, there's so much good stuff in here. Take that, I'll take it. Ah, uh, don't worry, I'm coming. Hey, there's this key card in here too. <gasps> he had two neuromods. Not surprising. Well done. Yes. 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 Oh, I have his key card now. Okay, that's cool. Oh, here's his transcribe. I see it. Let's play it. No, no, no. Hold it. Hello? Hey, it's Langley. Are you a... Is there anything weird going on over there? No. Like what? I don't want you to panic. What is going on, Langley? Not sure yet. Security's running all over the place. So, everyone's still working there? I guess. I don't know. I've been in the lab all day. Hang on. I'm looking now. I don't... What was that? Oh my god. I think we just lost two labs. What? I have to go. What? You just lost two labs. Okay. That's, uh... That's not, uh, just a casual statement. <gasps> Ooh. What are you? What are you? What are you? Oh, Psy Hypos. God, I thought they were Neuromods for a minute. Uh, ooh, a safe. Can I get in here? Hacking three. Aw, oh, dang. Crap, I don't even know the combination for that. Maybe I'll find it someday. Ooh, what's that? Control panel? Tutorial? 
Huh? But it's repaired though. It's working fine. Breach fail safe. What? Um. Oh, so that's the door that I can go into. Hmm. Interesting. It's kind of hard to see because there's like, you know, it's not ideal. It's like flying a helicopter. Shotgun shells? <gasps> I don't have a shotgun yet. Oh boy. Oh boy. Okay. Uh, is that everything? We came to get what we needed to get. Right? Right? So we can go now, right? I'm surprised nothing has attacked us. I got lots of suit patch kits. In fact, I really need to prepare my spacesuit. So let's let's go ahead and do that. Uh, where is it? Yeah, let's just patch up our suit real quick. Because if we get attacked, we're kind of screwed. Uh, there's another headset that no one's using. Human corpses. Airlock psychotronics. Can I get in there? Wait, do I want to get in there? All right, let's try. Let's try to go for it. I'm probably gonna die, but we'll try. Oh my god! You can get hurt by slamming into things. I did not know that. I did not know that at all. Uh, here. We're gonna have to go back. We're gonna have to go back the way we came. I'm gonna take it real nice and real slow. Shit, that's gonna attack me, isn't it? Wait, what is that? <gasps> You're a nice operator! Come here! Come here, come here, come here. Can you help me? Oh, dang, that's the wrong one. Uh, it is what it is. It is what it is. But we're just gonna have to limp our way back. Oh, God. Okay. Yes, let's go back inside, please. Thank you. And let's get out of here. Yes. That wasn't as eventful as I thought it was gonna be, but, um, yeah. We made it to space. That was kind of cool, right? Yeah. Yeah? I don't know what to think of that. It's a little, hmm, kind of nothing going on. But I got lots of good shit. I got shotgun shells that I can't use. Because I do not have the shotgun yet. I really want the shotgun. I hope I was hoping the shotgun would be in my office, but it wasn't. So I don't know where it is. But I have so many bullets for my pistol that I honestly just kind of want to upgrade my pistol to make it more effective. Because I spent the time making the bullets to make the pistol more effective. Might as well use it. And use it effectively. I can't imagine how many things I'll kill with that thing. And... Oh, we're not back. God, this game takes forever to load. I'm gonna get me a solid state drive in that thing. Maybe it'll load faster. I didn't download the game, so maybe it's reading it from the disc? I don't know. Okay. Um, We're off to now. Dr. Calvino's workshop. That's right, because we got his key card. And now with his key... Now, how was I supposed to know I was about to die the instant I opened that door? It better have saved when I came back. Good. I'm gonna inch my way up to it. And then fire a thing at it. Alright, should be okay. <gasps> why is there a phantom in here? Uh, why? I cannot take a phantom right now. I can't. Maybe if I went upstairs... Where are you? Where are you? 
Hey, where are you? I need help. Shit. 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 Where is he? Oh god. I just need to get in there. I just need to get in there. Okay, I don't see him. I'm going for it. I'm going for it. Use the key card. I'm gonna close that door. Close it. Whew. Oh, okay. I feel better now, but at the same time, I don't. Because I know that there's a phantom out there. God, I am on the verge of death. Is there anything I can do? <gasps> okay, good. I have a med kit. I'm gonna have to use it. And eat some chips. Alright. Let's take our chances. This is Dr. Calvino's workshop. Okay. Leverage one. I do not have leverage one. <gasps> but I can possibly use a neuromod to get me some leverage one. All right, what was I saving for, to be honest? The, um, I needed four Neuromods for something. Tech weapons. You know what? I do not need leverage. I don't need leverage because I can always use a recycler charge to get rid of boxes. Except for the level three boxes because those are always a problem. But we're going to definitely spend this on this so I can upgrade my weapons even more. So, now that I have my inventory, do I have any weapon upgrade kits? No, I don't. But that's okay, because that unlocked more stuff that we can do, I think. Weapon upgrade kits. Oh, that's all it did. Okay, that's all it did was upgrade our weapon kits. But that's fine, because we can still get rid of this with some recycling charges. So I'm going to throw a recycling charge over there. Wait, what? What? Are these recycling charges, or am I, am I, or am I crazy? Are these EMPs? <gasps> Those are EMP charges! Oh, I am dumb. I am so dumb. I need to find a, um... I need to find something I can use to craft. Or hopefully, maybe I don't have to get in there. If I don't have to get in there, then maybe we're okay. I'm definitely taking those out of my hotbar, because that's not good. What was that? <gasps> oh shit, there's stuff over there. Um, Am I ready for that? I'm gonna sneak. I'm gonna sneak through, and hopefully it doesn't attack me. Looking glass console. No power! Alright, we need to get power to him. Power control terminal. Okay, I'm sneaking though. I'm sneaking. Can I power this on? Oh, there it is. Power on. What's happening? Okay, I trust everything's okay. I'm gonna go up here real quick and just have a look-see. See what's going on up here. Uh, suit parts, repair, engineering control systems. Uh, I've already read that. I read that in my, uh, my study. Lever leverage 2. What else? What else is there? Ooh, email! Ooh. Fried hard drive. I'll take that. Okay, what is this? Uh, Lawrence Calvino, uh, Mary, this is Dr. Calvino. I require that you fabricate a travel mug that weighs exactly 170 grams. Empty, of course. My feeble hands need a lightweight container for my coffee. Interesting. Interesting. Here, go down. I'll be sure to put it in a good word to Dr. Thornstein for your assistance. Interesting. Uh, Clive, this is Dr. Calvino. I'll need, I need you to modify a scale so that when it reads 170 grams, it will send an on-off signal. Please let me know when it's ready. Alright. Uh, I've had a look at the specs you sent me. I see a few problems. I didn't realize you'd offloaded so much processing and storage. What if someone took a wrench to the main server? The whole system goes down. Anyway, come by when you get the chance and we'll go over the details. I have a few suggestions if you're available. Jorgen. Interesting. 
Alright. So, that was cool. Let's go see what we can do with the looking glass. And wrap up the episode. Better be something good. Video playback. So, looking glass display. What's the point of this? <gasps> Wait, no. This was supposed to enable the server, right? Diagnose network servers. Yeah, that's what we're doing. Is disconnected. Diagnose screens. All screens intact. Okay. Uh, server connectivity. Verify and restore. Oh, we'll go through these one at a time. Restoring connection. Okay. Connection restored. Nice work, Morgan. The looking glass screens are online again. Head okay. back to your office as soon as you can. It's important you hear the rest of your message. All right. I'll meet you there. <gasps> I get to meet January. All right. All right. All right. Cool. We're gonna leave this place because I don't feel safe in here. <gasps> Wait, there's stuff. Ooh, there's stuff. Sorry, I missed all this. Uh, I'll take that. I'll take that. I'll take that. What's in there? I'll take that. Mm, anything else? Anything else? Anything else before I go? Anything else before I go? Uh. Okay, I'm out of here. Oh shit. Um. I need to get back to my office. Uh. Here, let's close the door in here because there's a phantom outside. And I'm going to end this episode right here. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye.